Hi, this is Lou Agave, Long Island Lou Tequila. I'm at the Banco, now 1414 today, surrounded by these beautiful people, family and friends of the Banco. We're having a great time. I'm here to talk about this new Siempre product. Now listen, you don't know what this is because it doesn't tell you, right? It's going to be out in November. This is going to be the new Siempre Blanco, high proof, 54.5 ABV. It's called Muerto. So it's the opposite of what Vivo was, okay? Vivo, as we all know, same with this, cooked in a uh, stone brick oven, uh, shredder roller, maceration. Uh, Vivo is open air fermentation, it had wild yeast. This is all the same, except in Vivo, the uh, fermentation, they took some of the live yeast that was in the fermentation, and they took it and they put it into the distillation. So they actually fermented and distilled at the same time. This is sort of the opposite. They let the yeast die for 30 full days. It was dead, it was gone. And then they put it into the distillation. All right, you would think, you know, that's a whole different crazy thought, right? So that's what they did. It's, I'm uh, gonna try it right now. It's uh, high proof. Got a nice uh, citrus, uh, citrus, I would say uh, minty. Oh, it's got a nice presence, it really does. Totally different. Talking to Caesar and Oscar over here, maybe a little bit of almost a sour note, possibly because of the dead uh, musto. But it's different, it's funky a little bit, it's nice. Wow. It's gonna be sold in November for about $150, Siempre Muerto. You definitely wanna check this out, it's got a really unique, different, it's totally different. It's got a nice nose, it's got a nice taste. I like it a lot. It's really nice. Anise, licorice, mint, citrus. Something like this, you know, I would go with uh, about a 90 on Tequila Matchmaker when this thing comes out. This is really good. I would check it out. This is gonna be the Siempre Muerto. It's not gonna last long, so check it out real quick. Here we go.